Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, I'm John, this is Many a Trudet, and welcome back to Hitman for the next elusive target. Yeah, at this point, I can't actually remember which one this is. 13th? Possibly 12th or 13th? I genuinely can't remember. At this point, there's been so many, I don't know anymore. This is the first one that's taking place in the hotel, which is good, because that's a fun level, albeit I thought the mission there was not the strongest, but it's a fun mission, so it's good to see a brand new one showing up in the elusive targets. And, it is also the first elusive target with two targets. Now, that's interesting, of course, because elusive targets, you can restart over and over, until they're dead, at which point you're locked in at that point. So, well, or until you're dead. So there's the interesting raised stakes in this one, that if you kill one of them, presumably at that point, you're locked in, you can't replan. So you've got to make the other one work too. So, yeah, interesting. Let's have a look, see what's going on here exactly. Good afternoon, 47. Your targets are Richard Aquensi, former Central African dictator, and his gold digger wife, Inez. Following a broken departure from power, the targets have lived off the money they looted during their reign. The ICA has learned that the two will be at the Himapan Hotel in Bangkok at a clandestine meeting with a representative of French intelligence. The targets have been avoiding media attention in recent months and will likely not arrive at the hotel via the river. He takes no risks with his personal safety, so expect his security team to cover all possible approaches. The clock is ticking, 47. Good luck. Not arriving via river, high security. Okay, this is interesting. Fine, let's see what we've got going on here then. All right, let's take this seriously. Let's get the blood money suit on. Nice, good old blood money suit. Uh, I will bring my silver baller in just for the sake of flipping having it. Coins and fiber wires, fine. Let's start... What's going to be a good starting location? Hotel security wouldn't hurt. They can go a lot of places. Let's start with that. We can replan if need be. Let's just uh, head in there and see what goes on. Welcome to Bangkok, 47. On-site intelligence has confirmed that the target will arrive shortly and that the Himapan restaurant has had a last-minute booking for two. Good hunting. Ah, the restaurant. Okay, that's intriguing. Now... If he's not coming in via the sea, presumably, he'll be coming in via one of these two gateways, right? Thanks. Well, no sign of them showing up here. Yeah, let's head over to the restaurant and see if there's any sign of movement in there. No, nothing in here that I can see unless they're upstairs. They could be upstairs in, like, one of the private dining areas up there. Now, if they're both going to eat... A double poison might not be the worst thing in the world. Oh, hello. I've finally found flipping one of them. Uh, that was the woman, the gold digger, supposedly. Okay. So, let's figure out where you are. I've no idea how she arrived exactly. But as a half suspect, it looks like she's being escorted upstairs, probably to a private dining area up there. Turning through here. Ah, may have been here the whole time. In which case, am I allowed in a security? You, sir. She's going through. How about me? Hello? Yes? No? Okay, good. I'm fine. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, wait, what? Okay. So apparently, even though they didn't challenge me in any way, I'm not allowed in there anyway. Got it. All right, let's try kitchen staff. That's still staff, but if they're dining, that could work a bit better. Plus, I think some form of waiting or kitchen staff might be allowed upstairs into that room. All right, let's head over here. Now we know that probably he's in this direction. We've got ourselves one... Oh, one bartender there that sees through this disguise. Fine. No one else in here that appears to be relevant. Fine. Out this way. Through here, we've got ourselves... Ah! Is that the man at the end there? Oh, yes. Kind of looks like it. Lovely. Just through here. Quick as you... Ah, this is a hostile area too. Right, there's a lot of hostile areas here. Got it. You know what? Let's just start in my suite. Because that's technically a public area. So this will probably all work out just fine. Would you believe my suite happens to be directly above? Well, that is just bloody convenient, isn't it? So if I were to go... Yeah, if I were to just vault over here, you, round here. Down from there. Ah, I see the problem. Yeah, I see why you mind that. Okay, so there's a couple of guards right flipping there. Fine. So they're guarding the balcony. So just going in via the balcony way is going to be a no-go. In that case, let's try out a waiter disguise. Cause it felt like they just let a waiter in. 
Yep, somebody in this outfit most definitely was allowed through that door a moment ago. So let's just head that way ourselves and see... Excuse me, just just let me through, thank you. So it's just... Oh, no, you're going to see through that. That's fine. Head through here. Oh, bloody hell, that guy's already bloody suspicious. Fine. Well, let's just double check whether or not this will work. Then we will restart after that because it's already kind of gone to hell. But you were letting through a waiter a moment ago. Hello. Yeah, whatever. Go wait a table or something. Can, can I go wait these tables? Yes. Yes, I can. Okay, so. Waiting staff most definitely allowed in here. Fine. That works for me. Am I allowed in here? Yes, I'm allowed in here as well. So as waiting staff, I can just basically head through here. And then... Wow. In theory, could I just knock off both of these guys nice and quick? Uh, no, sadly, you can't be pushed. That guy could be pushed, but the other guy would see him, so that's not going to fly. Let's just go through here and just keep an eye on what's going on in this area for a sec. And in addition, we have... Ah! A third member of waiting staff. Then we've got these two right. Well, let's just see what happens here. If we just hide over here. Just just don't pay any attention uh, to me. Who are you hiding from? Oh, no one. Just like people. Go, 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 go. Right around here. Lovely. Stop. Yeah, that's stop. right. Don't don't mind me in the slightest. So, they're going to be over here. They're both having a sit down. Sadly, neither of those glasses are poisonable. Okay. They sit down here, order food. Then, they wander off in different directions. He heads over to... Yeah, she heads over here, so but she's being followed by two guards. Let's just find Where's out where he goes and what he's doing. Oh, wow. This is, this is, a, burner. This is a remarkably Tell easy point to uh, take this guy out, albeit nowhere to hide the that body. Right, there's a very obvious, easy way to get him, but let's figure out what we're planning to do for her before we actually do anything for certain. Oh, where did she just go? Well, she just went somewhere with her two security. Right. Oh, 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 flipping heck. A lot of people hey, see through this disguise, mind. Me. And just to double check, there's definitely no, no, there's no poisonable glasses here. I mean, I could try and get an explosive in. That could work. Actually, yeah. Okay, if I can't make this work now... Then I could just go for, when I say I can't make this work, if I'm just about to strangle this guy, then straight up it won't work. You know what? An explosive at the table would work just fine, as there's two of them. No, stick to the plan. The plan is what? Well, hang on, the plan's not good. The plan's not good because we know that guy cuts through this room. Although we also know there's no, there's no clear security there. If I go this way, let's just try stepping through this door. No, that's not trespassing or hostile. So... A fiber wire, right here. Yeah, okay. This is going to work right here. Right, they're separating. They've ordered, but the food will obviously uh, never come because everything they order seems to be out of stock. So, two of them wander over there. Those two guys, I believe, return to... Are they returning to balcony positions? Let's just find that out here. Okay, yep, fine. Are you guys returning to balcony positions? Or is... Ah, the person on the other end of the balcony... Is in fact, just make sure there's no one over here. No, we're good. Go. Down, 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 down. And then just drop. And now just go. And now just walk out like you own the place. Okay? Now go and change disguise. Ex dictator dead. The body's going to be found, which is fine. We just want to be not here when it happens. If I head down to the basement now, there's some good disguises to change into down there, including security. Down he goes. Get myself the uniform. Pop him straight in the box. Straight up out this way. Wait, hang on. Am I even allowed into this area? Is this area even allowed for me at the moment? Or... We just make double sure. Yep, fine. Okay. We're 100% fine. I've no idea how no one has found this body yet. But apparently no one's found the body. Which is remarkable, but good. Uh, right, okay. Obviously I have my own room key. I should have my own room key card. Okay, because I started as a waiter rather than as 47, it means I don't have the key card to my own room. Which means I'm going to have to get hold of a key card through some other mechanism. Which is, where's the bloody... Wait, I know where the master key card is. There's a 
There's a master key card down in the basement, in the laundry area. Here we are, master key card, lovely. Always can do with some of that. Spare throwable as well, always welcome. Nice and careful, where is she? Ooh, that might be her heading down to have a phone call outside right now. If so, this could be an excellent time for me to use that new master key card I've got. Lovely, master key card. Straight in here, over to my drop off. Get myself one nice thing there. Put that away, don't need it right now. It's a little bit ostentatious, to be honest, but I'm sure it's all fine. Now, step outside. Uh, as a guard, am I allowed to be here? Uh, yes, good. Yes, I've been recorded on security camera. That's annoying. I don't know if I'll be able to be bothered to be going and dealing with that. That's fine. And I've been recorded again. That's, that's fine again. I mean, looking at it, if she's going to be down in front of the restaurant... Potentially being, like, up on the top floor of the recording suite might actually work quite nicely. Or alternatively, one shot from a sniper rifle from the end of the pier up to there, and then straight onto the boat. That's actually a much better angle, yeah. Plus, there is the slight issue that right now I have literally no idea where the target is. I'm just kind of wandering around with a sniper rifle, hoping. I mean, right now, she's not there. None of those over there... A uh her. She could be... Yeah, none of those are her as well. Because she's got a distinctive, you know, obviously female silhouette. So she's relatively easier to uh, detect. So none of that over there is her. So does that just mean right now she is at the front of the... Ho oh, 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 careful. Flipping careful of her. Yeah, you know what? You... Okay, just go around the staff way. Hang on. No sign of her out front. No sign of her round here. Where exactly is she? Ah, okay, wait, hang on. We've got sight. Okay, we've got eyes on, but I can't get close to her right now. Now we just follow her and figure out what her routine currently is. Because mysteriously, he's not been found in that room where I just left him in the middle of the floor. One just lives in hope that they do not at any point get suspicious of the large, bold security officer with the sniper rifle staring really, really intently at the bottles of wine. Woman is on the move. Presumably she'll have her usual two security guards, yep, with her as she leaves. No way to poison a drink or food or anything, so don't worry about that. Which way is she heading now? Does she head down here? Same as she's done. No. She is going over to the bar. She no longer goes outside, she now goes exclusively to the bar, where, potentially, is she going to take a drink? Doesn't look like it. Looks like she's now just circling between the bar and the restaurant. Which could work, because the bar has windows. So, just in theory, I could take a sniper shot across the actual foyer of the hotel to her in here, right? Because you are just... Yeah, you're literally just staying in the bar area itself. Now you're going over... Oh. No, you're not taking a drink. You are just standing there. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. Uh, in which case, out here, let's just have a quick look-see at what we've got in terms of that... Bar. Yeah, there she is. Right there in front of that window. If I could just find a quiet window on the other side, I might be able to take her out like that. Hang on, hang on. No, no, no. Careful, careful, careful. And now she's just going to return to the restaurant, presumably. She's done going outside for the minute. Now she just goes backwards and forwards here. Fine. Okay. Let's go and find myself a place to set up on the other side of the building. A quiet room where one quiet sniper shot would hopefully Secure. never be noticed. Yeah, so that's the bar there. I need to either be here looking in this direction or over here looking in this direction. But in both cases, we've got the small problem of there's probably glass in the way, so I don't have particularly clear vision. I wonder if I could just fire one silenced bullet. I mean, I assume a silenced bullet would actually break the glass. Right? Probably. 
Okay, let's just go to a nice safe location to test this. Ignore the guard with the increasingly large number of guns. Okay. There's no one around here, right? No, there's no one around here. Test if we can just break glass. No, we can't. Glass, that glass is bulletproof. Doesn't shatter. Well, I don't know if it's bulletproof, but it just didn't shatter. Which probably means we've got... Yeah, we won't be able to shoot down through it. Ah. Security is indeed allowed right here. I thought they weren't. Well, that's good. What is... No, that's okay. I don't want to go through. All I want to do is go... Oh. Are you going to see through this disguise? No. No, you're not. Okay, fine. That's all good. Me and you. Totally cool. Totally friends. So we've got... Ah. This window here could be the one I want. The problem is, it's a little bit crowded. And that's the flipping security office. <laughs> right there. Okay. So, this is going to be intriguing. But... But this room right here, 104, does this have a... No, this doesn't have a... Oh, yes it does. This has a window pointed at just the right angle. No, that is not going to work. I mean, I think I'm looking at the right window, but there's no way of actually nailing that shot. Not a chance. Bloody trees are in the way. No, this sniper shot idea is not going to fly. Okay, I have a new plan, which is we're going to go back to being a waiter. This may seem like a bad plan, but it's pretty much the only plan I've got right now because the waiter's the only one I know who can access, well, you know, the bar area. Though admittedly, that other waiter will have to go down. None of you are going to have trouble with me, right? We're all going to be good. Yeah, okay, so in she comes again. I'm just going to loop around the long way. Just in... Oh, hello. Oh, oh, oh. Who's, oh, no, so that's the guy downstairs. Not a guy ahead of me. That's fine. Now we've got multiple guys ahead of me who totally can see through this disguise. You go backwards and forwards between serving her and not. We've got one guy back here who can totally see through this disguise. Um, But there's a freezer here. There is a freezer here and the option to get rid of him. If we can just get rid of this guy, I'll have some unrestricted access to the bar. That's probably worth taking a risk to get hold of, albeit I kind of should have done that, you know, before I actually killed the guy. But we do have one of the bartenders. Oh, flip. Flip, guys. Guys, there's too many bartenders who are going to see straight through this disguise here. I don't like this one little bit. And then, yeah, okay, so we got one of you guys right here, potentially. Okay. So if I could just get both of these guys down. All right, screw it. We just need to start doing this. Hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. That noise is supposed to something, something, something. You're going to go and investigate that. Turn it back on again. Yep, fine. As soon as he's turned it back on again. And we're good to... Danny goes, Danny goes, Danny goes, Danny goes, Danny goes, Danny goes, Danny goes. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, no. No, 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 no. That's not fair. That's not fair. Oh, I should have just snapped his... Oh, no. Okay, this is about to go horribly wrong because everyone saw that happening. Right, no, no, it's fine. Don't shoot at me. Shoot at the other guys who are not... No, the other guys who are not... Oh, flipping. No. Well, that went well. <laughs> oh, well. That's, that's two I've been murdered in so far. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you don't do the ex-dictator. Or to be precise, a very important life lesson about how you don't commit to something until you've actually got some sort of a plan of how to do it. Because I didn't have any form of plan for dealing with her, and as a result, that's how that ended up. What I should have done is I should have taken out all of the waiting staff first because that's the easy bit before focusing on him or her. That would have worked much better. Or just gone with the blowing them up with the mobile phone on the table plan. That would have also been relatively reliable. But we didn't do that. We tried to do it the stupid way. And as a result, we died. So that's two failures. Oh, well, never mind. I've got my blood money suit. I'm broadly happy anyway. And my understanding is we've got more elusive targets coming up soon anyway. So I will be able to redeem myself once again. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been many a true nerd. And this has been how not to do the ex-dictator in Hitman. Thank you very much and goodbye.
Don't mind me. I've been practicing my stabbing motion. It's fine. Oh, you shouldn't have got in the way. You must die. You showed up to a party and you brought a guitar. I despise you. There's two people who are just having sex in this corridor. They're going to go down. Stab, stab. There we are. Like Romeo and Juliet, but sped up slightly. It's the it's kind of the footnotes version. 